Hi there, here's Tati from Emios. Now I would like to show you how you can create an event. An event can be a meeting or a concert, for example. To create a new event, click on a plus in a product list panel. In the basic tab, choose event as product type. Then you need to enter a unique code for your event. It must be unique across all products. The label is also required and will be used in the front end if there is no text or event name added. A special thing about events is that they are also displayed if the start date is in the future. And events are also automatically hidden when the end date has passed. In the Media Sub panel, you can add one or more images that are shown for the event. In the Text tab, add the text you would like to add for your event. Each text, you must select the language and the type. First, add an event name and the short description. Both will be shown in the list page and the long description for the details page. Switch to the prices tab. You must at least add one price so the event can be added to the basket. Insert the tax rate and the price value and choose the currency for that price. Move on to the stocks tab. You must add a new stock entry for your event. Otherwise, you can't put it into the basket. So enter how many events you can currently sell. And last, switch to the categories tab. Your event must be assigned to at least one category to show up on the front end. Now save your event and have a look at the front end. So here's the event you have created, including the image, the name, the short description, the stock level, and the price. You can see the event even though the start date is in the future. In the details page, you can also see your long description. And you can add your event to the basket. Ta-da! Thanks for watching. See you. You're Tati from Memios.